welcome back to Fashion Hut. We have been discussing art, and my guest today is Miss Denise Henry. Miss Henry, tell me about what you paint on, like the type of material that you use. Okay, my medium is acrylic on canvas. Um, that's it, acrylic on canvas. I that's work the well. Only one. You the that's the one well, that works for you. Yes, I'm experimenting now and then with oil, oil and canvas, yes. Tell us about art and the family life, how do you balance the two? Wow, okay. As a matter of fact, uh, my kids are my inspiration. This wonderful piece you see right here was designed by my little ones, um, Ailey and Quentin. They're three and five, respectively. Yes, they helped me create this design and I, I'm really pleased with it. This is one of my new products. This painting is called Sunny Mood. Okay. Mm -hmm. I like it, very interesting. Yes. Tell us what other artists do you look up to or draw inspiration from? Whoa. Other than your dad, of course. Actually, my, uh, actually, I admire a lot of artists, but I was trying to stay focused in my head because a lot of a lot of these drawings right here were seen in my mind's eye. I would close my eyes and and these designs come into my mind's eye. Look at other artists' work and yeah. draw inspiration from it. No, I do buy other. I would buy other artists' work because it does something to me. Um, but. They said um, I'm similar to a Mandrian, is a um, 20th century famous artist, and and I don't know. I just try to do my thing, stay focused. You know. Can you say you painted acrylic. Um, acrylic. For my viewers, would you please tell us what that is? Acrylic paint is it's a cross between watercolor paint and oil paint. Um, it dries faster than oil paint. Um, Watercolor paint, uh, it's watercolor paint, but you know, it, it's between, it's closer to oil paint, but it dries faster than oil paint. And it's easier to work with? It's easier, well, I wouldn't say it depends on your preference, but um, I find the oil paint is really good to um, blend, it's good for blending, but I, I feel much comfortable in, comfortable in um, acrylic. Yes. Well, um, to me, my art is like fashion. You can never please everyone. I would love my viewer to, to associate with me and to buy my art because it does something to them. Either they bring them back to a pleasant memory, they, it uplifts them, gives them a good you know, vibe. You know, really relate to it. Um, you want them to bring them by, you want them to be a part of it, you want them to kind of experience something like you were experiencing when you were doing it. Exactly. And that's by, a, a, you know, for instance, like a Gucci because it's a Gucci. I want them to love it because when they're broke, <laughs> I want to be able to say, oh, I'm pleased to buy that piece. It helps in the moment. All right, tell us how important is it for a home to have like a piece of art in it? It makes a difference, huh? It really does. Because I know you say something about the empty spaces, like you just not get to see the wall, just there. Yeah, that's one of the things that drove me into art. Um, the, the walls of my empty, um, the walls bothers me, you know, to be empty. And I figured a little piece of art there with a little incorporation of the color yeah, would be nice. Yes, definitely. What do you think about painting versus like photography? Oh, um, photography is, I mean, art is art, like I said, and if you have an eye for photograph, it's good, but art is more, it's in the risk, and it, it's also in the mind and, and intuitive, exactly. You can just take a picture. Yeah, like, yeah, it's like, for instance, you can never see a photograph, photograph anything like this. And this cannot be photographed, you know, there's nowhere, you have to paint this. Yeah, it's one of those contemporary designs. Yes. We'll be speaking to Miss Henry a bit more. I know you don't want to miss it, so stick and stay. Fashion Hot, we'll be right back.